on the shores of Fort Myers Beach. Happy Thanksgiving. A Thanksgiving feast is being shared within the community. We literally started digging tables and chairs out of debris piles, getting them cleaned off. Here we are. Here is the Beach Baptist Church off Estero Boulevard. Thank you. You're welcome. Where remnants of Hurricane Ian are scattered all around. Make them feel at home. A little normalcy is, is big in the tore up world. A small slice of normalcy being offered we got green beans. with a hot meal. Our private vendor who's been helping us cook meals every day, twice a day for three weeks, said let's do Thanksgiving. So this is what we got. What they've got are dozens of Fort Myers Beach residents sitting side by side, gathered over a Thanksgiving Day meal. Honestly, we've been saying let's cook for 200. We never thought it would actually be that many people, uh, and yet we're, we went away over it. With the exception of a special guest, former Vice President Mike Pence. It's a privilege for Karen and I to be in Southwest Florida. The former Vice President touring the church with his wife, seeing Ian's damage firsthand. We thought there'd be no better place to be on Thanksgiving Day than here encouraging people who've been through so much over the last two months since Hurricane Ian came ashore, but have shown a resilience and a faith and a generosity that uh, that you see in this gathering today. A day that has some feeling a little more thankful than the day before. Thankful for the fact that we can be thankful every day. You know the best days for this region are uh, lie ahead and uh, it'll once again be an extraordinary place that recovers from this very, very difficult time. On Fort Myers Beach, Calvin Lewis, Fox 4.